Antonio de la Torre was warmly welcomed on his arrival at the San Sebastian Film Festival. The actor gives a memorable performance in Rodrigo Sorayan's new film, The Kingdom. The Madrid-born director has already won the silver shell for best screenplay for Que Dios Nos Perdone. His latest offer is a political thriller. Manuel is part of a kingdom where politicians and businessmen live, but his world is gradually crumbling as a result of leaks to the press. What we don't want to say is you're all guilty in the sense of we want to save someone. No, we want to show a world in which it's very difficult not to be corrupt. But at the same time, we want for the spectator to see that they're not so different from us. As part of his character building, De La Torre spoke to real politicians. But above all, he knows what he wants to portray. For me, the core of the task is to capture the soul, as, as if it were a game. As an actor, you have three possibilities, the walking, the talking or the soul. I'll keep the soul. Our correspondent says if Rodrigo Soroyan's previous film was a dirty thriller, this one is much more sophisticated, but it serves to portray the filth of the political class. This is the first major Spanish production in this Zinimaldia, and during its screening, the Donosti Prize was also awarded to the Japanese filmmaker Hirokazu Koreeda. Carlos Marlaska, Euronews, San Sebastián.